I beg you, Alessandro. We've always been friends. Please don't ruin everything. Don't sacrifice your soul. Please, let's go back to being friends. Breathe a word, I'll kill you. Got that? Shh, quiet. I said I'm gonna kill you. Hello. Hello, Father. Doctor? What happened? The contract with Mazzolini has been changed so many times, we decided to call a halt to everything. And the Count? The doctor says that, for retaliation, he stopped giving us the Queenine. He knows the police won't be coming back. No one is allowed to take the law into their own hands. File a complaint with the officials and see how quickly he falls in line. It is your right. If you all don't do it, I will do it. This morning we have a communion. Hmm. Let's go, little girl. Leave it for me to do later. No little girl has ever been so lovely. <laughs> Did Mrs. Albertini lend you a veil? Yes. Let's go now. Today, no. Aren't you eating anything, Maria? You're not supposed to eat before going to communion. Doesn't bother me, really. It doesn't bother me at all. And actually, I don't even know if I'm going to eat at all. We could have asked to borrow some new shoes for me, too, don't you think? Jesus looks inside your heart, not at your feet. Straight from the Count's wife in person. So, my little miss, are you ready for your big day out? Hmm? At least this once you don't have to walk all the way. Let's go. We'll be right there. The body of Christ. Amen. The body of Christ. Amen. The body of Christ. Amen. Body of Christ. Amen.
<laughs> I ask you to forgive me, if ever I could badly in the past. I will try not to do it again. <laughs> I ask you to forgive me if sometimes you ask me to look after the children and I left it for you to do. <laughs> what are you talking about, dear? It is us that you need to forgive. So young and yet you do so much for us. I have to ask you to forgive me too for having badly men in your shirts. And for not Always understanding. You're so beautiful. If only your father were here to see you now. Oh, like a bride. <laughs> when the right groom comes along, I won't have to recognize him. God will point him out to me. And I will love him forever. Like you and Dad. <laughs> Oh, the Bordens. Thank you for attending the Mass. These occasions mean so much more when we can celebrate together as a family. Good morning, twins. Actually, we came to say goodbye, Father. We're leaving Conquer. We weren't able to settle things with the Count in his terms, so... He said he'd decide when the contract was no longer valid. But he can't kick you out of your homes. He already did, Father. He didn't even think twice about it, he just did it. <laughs> 